Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNet and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the That Much Difficulty. As you can see, we're still at the Kertrol the Harbor and we're going right underneath Kertrol the Bridge right now. Because as you remember in the previous episode, we're going to go after the Sunstone, but the cavern containing the Sunstone is actually blocked off by, uh, well, it's not really accessible by land, that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. So we need to go there by boat. So uh, I guess I'll see you guys in a minute at the cavern entrance. After a bit of a boat trip, you can see there's already a boat waiting for us there. Should we have swam here, which I think I did in the uh, first time I did this. Because I, well, I was kind of a doofus on that quest. So let's leave the helm. I uh, swam all the way here, which wasn't really a good idea because that took a while. Uh, so there's even a marker here, so we could fast travel away if needed. And here's Philippa. Just wonderful. What? Hey, look at this. What is just wonderful? What's this? Stuff. Okay. Thanks. Why didn't Let's you do go. that before? What now? Gonna grow yourself some new eyes, like Vilgefortz did. Is and she? Remember the moment I killed him. She looks like she has. wasn't complete. They hadn't grown in fully yet. Looked disgusting, but I take a it flashlight. Of that deviant was purely coincidental. Of course. Also heard of this rich blind dwarf from Mahakam. Had them put two sizable rubies in his eye sockets. Hear that? Hmm. So uh, Vilgefortz, the guy they were talking about, was the leader of the sorcerers and sorceresses before the uh, rebellion uh, surrounding Ciri that took place in the books. Uh, and he kind of took out a gravely wounded Geralt. Would you please get your fucking sword out? Get your sword out, thanks. Not that I need a lot of help with... Uh... Okay, Travis, where the fuck did he go? Okay, there she goes. And then there's a siren flying around in the cave. That doesn't... That doesn't strike me as a great idea. Ooh, there's even a place of power down there. Is that siren just gonna keep doing that? Heading down. Okay, where the fuck did you go? Um, okay. This is more than a little weird. That's true. But there's a place of power here, so... Thank you very much for another ability point, which we'll spend immediately. Give me a second. So, uh, muscle memory upgrade. There we go. That was easy. Igni sign intensity increased, which is also very handy. And Philippus hand is still uh, active as a way of saying that. Oh. That doesn't look like a great idea. So how do we get up the... The stairs? I'll fix them right away. Don't fall off now. They're still kind of blind. Although you can see her eyes glowing beneath her uh, her blindfold. Look at that. Well, it's Ready. kind of repaired. Couldn't have noticed the tension between you and Yennefer and Triss. It's very hard on Siri, I think. Um, please shut up. There are times I doubt you three realize how it looks. Triss plays a big sister to Siri, but eagerly awaits a chance to hop in bed with you. You and Yennefer play Hi. parents. <laughs> that was a burn. Well, uh, this is not making things easier, is it? Uh, 
let's dive under it. And down. Woo! That always takes a while. Especially on this difficulty. Okay, Philippa, lead the way. I will follow where you go. As long as you lead me towards that sunstone. What now? It appears I must do everything for you. Uh, apparently. See the sentry who seems to be waiting for payment. I'm fresh out of change. Ugh, in blood, not coin. The sentry is Fearland of the Elven legend. Do you literally read nothing? Yeah, apparently I, I don't read enough. Oh God, why always so violent? Although I pretty much have read everything there is to read in this game so far. So that everybody is still informed if they're following the story. There you are. Those flashlight eyes are really disturbing. Especially with the pattern on her blindfold. Yennefer okay. must have a tremendous pull with the Emperor to get him to guarantee the Lodge's safety. What's your take on it? My take? Obviously a leading question. No. Geralt, I'm tired. Let's sit and chat a bit first. Oh, she's wearing a candle on her middle. That's what's giving out the light. It's a bit overblown, but uh, not excited to work with the Emperor. Probably you not. to work with the Emperor. Not excited? No. I, I mean, yes, of course I am. Thus far, the Lodge has oft banked on weak rulers. It's been one of our biggest mistakes. Hmm. <laughs> So you're impressed Emir keeps his mages on a short leash? Yennefer's wise to keep you out of politics. I'm afraid you'd not realize which way the wind was blowing if you pissed straight into it. Ah, oh, so friendly all the time. Hash it out with Yennefer. You to talk to Yennefer. Painfully clear there's unfinished business there. Yennefer's always walked her own path. I'm actually touched she decided to take an interest in the matters of the Lodge this time. You don't trust her. So once the hunt's defeated, leave. Find asylum elsewhere. I hear Redania's offering. I'd sooner stick my head in a Zoogle's spiky orifice. Thanks, but I've other plans. Okay, sounds interesting though, but I can't ask further about that. So, uh, the deal with Emir is sorcerer's business, this as deal it is. With Emir. It's sorcerer's business. Pick someone else's brain. So she's not told you anything? What about personal plans? Has she mentioned anything? A possible advisory position? Beside a young, promising empress? Yeah, we know you're talking about Siri. She's an adult, Geralt. You keep forgetting. She can decide for herself. So, onward. Yes. Onward. Don't you think it's time you stopped interfering in Siri's life? I think yeah. I did a pretty good job of not interfering. Wolves, you can just drive away from her with your sword. Sure you are. And yes, I can. If the need arises. <laughs> that was um, threatening. We're going Wait. from one cutscene to the next, There's aren't we? Here. Feel it? What's no, that on the ceiling? Medallion. A ridiculous bauble. Don't make me laugh. Tuning into elven magic is just slightly more difficult than sniffing out a malodorous fiend. Watch this. Arahan Luma! That thing in the ceiling there, that's not normal, is it? Yes, indeed. I was right. Uh -huh. That means the sunstone is here. Don't stand there looking stupid. Try to shift the mirrors. Oh. Yeah, okay. Shift the mirrors towards what, exactly? So let's go left first. Because that seems to be the mirror I can access the fastest. Not really sure what the point of it all is. Because it looks... It just does that. Which now makes it turn into a circle. Um, well... Oh, that was not what was I 
what I was wanting to do. So let's go around here. Philip is already going this in this direction. There's still something standing there. It looks like a knight of some sort. Ghost! Hi, ghost! Hello, ghost! Oh, ghost is down. I can even loot the ghost. Potion from Tiernalia, Wild Hunt Warrior Sword. Interesting. Um, um, not really sure now. Let's go back down. Try and access that third one over there. And I think there's another ghost through there as well. Let's blast these thingies out of the way, because they're kind of in my way. So we can climb up here. Swap back to Quan, because I'm going to need it, fighting against that ghost. Did he just scream gals? Oh, curse you, that means. Don't really have trouble with these guys. So let's swap this one around as well. Let's do it like this. Now I need to probably swap the other one again. Oh, that was way too high. And I kind of wasted a swallow on that one. Let's climb up. Let's climb up. And let's jump. There we go. I'll probably pull this one again. Pull. No, what are you doing? God damn it, just pull. Found it. Okay, that did something. Found it? Yeah, I found it. God damn it. So that pointed the light towards over there, and that must have opened something over here. What the hell? Where the hell is she? Examine the sunstone. Oh, look at that. Pretty. Does it heal your Last. wound as well? Hand it over and let's get out of here. Not so fast. We have a matter to discuss. Let okay then. You gotta fly. You're about to tell me why you need the sunstone so much more than we do. Then you'll change into an owl and whoosh. No idea where you got such a ridiculous notion. <laughs> Serious safety is most important to me now. She's so sarcastic and sometimes. I wish to talk to you about the future. My future. Okay. I recommend the Alpine Air of Nazir. Emperor's got plans for you, I'm sure of it. Hmm. Don't know if that will uh, do anything. I wouldn't worry. Emperor's got plans for you, I'm sure. Stop playing with Jester and listen to me carefully. Once we've defeated the hunt and Siri is safe, Yennefer's meteoric rise at the Imperial Court will come to an abrupt end. It probably which is will. From my perspective, I'm not interested in reviving the lodge if I'm not to have the deciding vote. Which she had the first because... time around. If I know even one bit, I expect that once we've defeated the wild hunt, you aim to slip out the back door with Siri. To disappear into the wilds, correct? Well, that's the plan. All if it's going to work, it's something else. But perhaps instead of destroying the girl's life, you could take Yennefer with you and go. That's also the plan, I think. Um, you want to take Yen's place beside Samir, which is, of course, a logical decision for her. You want to take Yen's place at Amir's side. And at Ciri's. I think you understand it's inevitable, and I would truly prefer Yennefer to be far away when it happens. Holding I don't think that should be a problem. Would be costly, and it would give the wrong impression. Because uh, Yennefer, we have romantic involvement with Yennefer alone, so uh, we could start a life with her, but uh, as for now, can we go? 
Any other words of wisdom, or can we go? You may go. I know you've things to do. I can find my own way back. Oh. I sometimes wonder why she turns into an owl instead of just using the fucking portal. Uh, let Avalok know everything is ready. So that was the Sunstone quest. Which was actually done faster than I thought it would be. And we leveled up again. It's level 34 and now we're... Oh god. Hello! Now we're even uh, high enough of a level to start blood and wine without any problems. Let's swap between these guys. And now she flees. I'm alternating between these two guys, but seems to be the best tactic. There we go. Crystallized essence. Uh, more crystallized essence. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, what I was wanting to say, it's done faster than I expected, but uh, I guess we'll have to do with that. Because in the next episode, I'm not going to start it just yet, because of course the next episode will be the grand finale of the main quest. Because now that we have the sunstone, we can uh, easily, well, easily is maybe putting it lightly, we can summon the Nagelfar, the ship of the Wild Hunt and uh, lure it towards a place of our choosing which in turn aids us in uh, setting up a trap for Aridin and the wild hunt in general but that will have to wait until the next episode I'm glad I actually found the entrance so f the exit so fast oh god damn it we're not over not over yet more ghosts There we go, another ghost down. And hopefully this actually leads towards the exit. Although, whoa, what the hell? I think I accidentally fell into a giant pile of treasure. Accidentally. Look at that. Okay, thanks. So let's head outside right now. Looks like that's the exit. Yay! Sunlight monster den. Yeah, we kind of cleared out that monster den. But, so, next episode. Final, final battle against the wild hunt. Yeah, god damn it, put that away. Against the... Stop switching swords. Put it in there. Against the wild hunt and uh, Aridin himself. So, I hope you guys look forward to that. Uh, so, see you guys in two days, of course, as usual. But uh, for now, thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And if you haven't already, give it a thought to subscribe to my channel. Because I'd really appreciate any support you can give me. So, uh, next episode, the finale of the main quest of The Witcher 3. So thank you guys again enormously for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video or stream. Goodbye!